everyone and welcome to another Scrimming Frog Quickfire Guide. This time on saving, opening, exporting and importing crawls. Crawls can be saved and reopened back up in the SEO Spider with a license. Saving and opening crawls works a little bit differently depending on your configured SEO Spider storage mode. If you're unfamiliar with storage modes, it's essentially a configuration option under configuration, system, storage. The default uh, storage mode is memory storage mode, which saves crawl data to RAM. So it requires you to save the crawl to save the data. So I'm going to perform a crawl now just on the Screaming Frog website. I'll pause it and you can see 28 URLs have already been crawled. To save this data, I just need to go to file, save, and I can save that crawl. I can then clear the crawl, go to file, open, and I can reopen that crawl and resume the crawl again. Now this works a little bit differently in database storage mode. Using the magic of video, I've just switched to a database storage mode. So saving and opening crawls works a little bit differently in database storage mode. You don't need to manually save crawls like you do in memory storage mode as .seo spider files. So you can actually just start a crawl pause it and there's no save as you can see under file save you can simply clear the crawl and it will be saved so I can clear the crawl and go to file crawls and this is where all the crawls will appear automatically they're automatically committed here so you will need to delete crawls and you can do that just by clicking the delete button but to reopen the crawls you just need to click the open button and again you can resume the crawl now you can also export crawls and obviously share them with colleagues still. So you can go to file, export, and there's two ways to do this. You can export them as a database file, which obviously users who are using database storage mode will be able to open. Memory storage mode users will not be able to open the database file, but you can also change the file type. You can save it as a .seo spider file and then memory storage mode users will be able to open up that crawl as well. However, you can import as both file types in database storage mode. So I can just go to file import and I can open up any database files here, but I can also change to .seo spider files. So here's the crawl that I performed earlier in memory storage mode. I can reopen up that crawl and it will commit to the database and then it will also appear again and open quickly under the file crawls menu. Now there are some advantages to using database storage mode. The main advantage is that obviously crawls are saved automatically. Now, if you experience a power cut or Windows performs an update, you forget to save the crawl or uh, you experience a crash or something along those lines, generally your, your crawl will be stored automatically. So you actually, you won't lose the crawl. You can just go to the file crawls menu and reopen it back up and resume from where you left off. There's another main benefit as well is that crawls open a lot quicker in database storage mode so if you're performing particularly large crawls you'll want to use database storage mode anyway because you can perform larger crawls but actually when you go to reopen those crawls database files open much quicker than the older .seo spider files in memory storage mode so that's our recommended storage mode anyway i hope you'll find that useful on opening saving exporting and importing crawls thanks